Jordan Tower with JT News. Well, we got some updates on Kodak Black. Uh, basically, you know, he was supposed to be out right now. They were going to let him go on all his charges, you know, the kidnapping, the gun charge. They were going to they weren't going to give him felony charges. They were going to let him go on a year, a five year probation, one year house arrest. They were going to be very lenient on him because he's so young. He's only 19. The judge didn't want to ruin his life so early. I mean, he's just getting into becoming a rapper, making legit money. And she sees that he can, like, kind of change his life around. While they're processing him, two more warrants come up. Actually, three came up. Now, two of the warrants are in St. Lucie County, Florida. And they're for, like, weed. So, like, that's, that's like a fine. It's like a small fine now. Weed isn't treated like, you know, some big felony or anything now. It's just, you know, it's a fine. You pay a fine. It's a money thing, you know. The bad one is from... I think Florence, South Carolina, and this is a sexual um, conduct first degree. So this could be, it's probably, it's probably rape. Now, I'm not saying he raped the girl, but he's famous. What do these thotties out here think? Oh, I'm going to sleep with them. They probably thought he was going to, you know, be their new girlfriend. And then he left town and she was like, you know, rape charge. That's the problem with, uh, that's the problem with our judicial system. You can accuse any, girls can accuse any guy of rape now. And you're, you're, you know, in, in other people's eyes, you're guilty of proven innocent. But, you know, they say you're innocent to proven guilty. So what they're going to do is they're going to extradite him from Florida to South Carolina and they're going to figure it out there. Now, most likely he'll get bailed out and then he can get home to house arrest and fight this. And probably it'll get dropped because there's probably not any evidence. The girl probably just didn't do a rape kit or anything because it probably wasn't even rape. It was probably consensual. I mean, let's be honest. Look at look what happened with Kobe and a bunch of other people. If you're famous, you're a target, man. You can't be sleeping with the thotties, man. Got to have a girl. But anyways, we will have to see what happens here. I hope Kodak Black gets out sooner than we think, man. You know, like I hope his I hope his lawyers push this along and get him out here by, you know, let's say this is going to probably take a month. So one more month, we should have Kodak Black home making more good music. I know you miss his music just like I do. And, you know, I hope I hope Kodak. This is a wake-up call. Change your life around. Be legit. Make those millions. And, you know, support your family, man.